Ninjas, welcome back to the channel. F Dash here with F Dash TV. It is August 19th, 2024, and these are the best farms this week in TMNT Legends. So, normally, I would have just re recorded the video from what is it, April 29th, that had Nick Donnie on it, but there's a different challenge. At least, there's one different challenge. So, I can't use the exact same video, so here is an actual new video. So yes, the tournament is a repeat of Nick Donnie. I've already talked about him in terms of um, why you should farm him. You know what? I, I'm going to go ahead and make an executive decision. He was not going to be this week's spotlight, but because he is this tournament for this week, I'm going to go ahead and move him up. And on Wednesday, we will be discussing Nick Donnie. So if you're interested as to why you should be farming him, if you should be farming him at all, Tune in on Wednesday where we talk about Nick Donnie. Uh, as far as challenges go, graphic violence, that challenge we don't talk about. Uh, we do have Usagi versus Swift at the end of the week for our legendary challenge. Uh, Swift is the most... Oh, hold on, let me make sure I, I'm a Swift. Swift is... Swift is yellow, right? Oh, gosh. I believe Swift is yellow. I could be completely wrong. Hold on, let's go look. Because what is blue? Blue is spear. Okay, yeah, so Swift is yellow. And it is the hardest Usagi challenge in the game. Because Usagi, yes, I know. Usagi is. Okay, I just did this. Usagi is naturally dominant over Swift characters. So, again, this is going to be the absolute hardest one. If you want to know the best team, I have a post. On my YouTube channel, just scroll down a little bit, where I actually post the best team for this. It's really not that difficult, to be completely honest with you, if, especially if you have Nick Mikey. Um, Mondo is really helpful as well. Uh, probably the most helpful is going to be LARP Raff. Um, and then you can join him with either VQ Leo or Classic Mikey. Uh, just know that you will be at a type at disadvantage. And then to go along with that, we do have Swift Gear for the Platinum Challenge. Uh, this one, again, is pretty easy, so not too bad there. Uh, but again, Nick Donatello is your tournament character for this week, so of course, regardless of who the character is, you should be trying to get as high as possible in the tournament so that you can get the most amount of mutagen. This is going to be your best source of mutagen. If you can make it to Master 3, if you can't, then of course the Gauntlet. Please play the Gauntlet, guys. I already rented last week. Please play the Gauntlet. But both of those are going to be your main one-two punch for mutagen resources. And again, come back Wednesday. We'll discuss why or why not Nick Donatello is worth your time. All right, guys, that's going to do it for me. Thank you so much for watching. Come back Wednesday, like I said, and we'll discuss more TMNT Legends. Thank you guys so much again. Take it easy. We'll see you next time.